guys, what's up? It's Tiffany and welcome back to my channel. Today we are back playing The Sims 4, The Not So Berry Challenge. Today we are going to be continuing getting our education on for our teens. If I recall last time, we're about two days away from aging up. They're both A plus students. Um, last episode we aged up forest and we had our new baby brother hunter who is a alien and in this episode i think we're going to finally age up ruby into a young adult and we're going to send her off to university so let's get into it all right so our girl over here is awake so why don't you come over here and practice debating and then we're gonna have a debate club meeting so, gather at a library. So, let's debate a topic. Is college worth it with, let's debate with Lindsay. Hey, Blaine, Gora. Clarabin, Lipiform, Silicane, Close, Scoon. Yenzi, Sharky, Tazorka, Darn, 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 what? Sue, Charlie, uh, Harmony, Nib 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 Meeting's over, guys. And then we're going to plan a social event. Alright, so we're going to throw a house party. Host is going to be us. And we're going to invite. Let's invite him. Her, 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 her. We don't want to invite Cory because we're gonna try and kiss Max Swan, so Cory can't come. She can come now. So, girl, why are you in that outfit? Change immediately. It's <laughs> 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 so weird, but we need to get a kiss. So, Yazu. we're gonna get a nighttime kiss. What's the rule? Oh, uh, she Apollo Chaba, Chris. Scrape the narch. Oh no, she Dad. just peed herself. Man. Um, Hunter aged up and he is in the oh, oh my goodness. He is an alien to the T. We're going to fix him up and cast really quick. Alright, so this is Hunter's <laughs> new look. We fixed him up in Cass. He's actually really cute. And his alien look is... Yeah, a little... <laughs> a little scary. It's fine. Right. I need to fix up a little Todd. Um, room. So... I don't really have anywhere to put him. So, we're just gonna put him in our room. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, we're gonna have to put him in our room. And so, just until... The girls leave. They age up in two days, so why don't you come in here and play some sim shape? But girl, why don't you go oh. here and yeah, oh, yeah. 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 trip? Come on. Maybe ask about his attractive preferences. 
Telling us to your brief moments of silence for Rocky and express that he doesn't Sinesh have any homework and things to Varric. say that but would sure. satisfy Rosie. Perhaps Rosie is already Sick attractive enough in the eyes of Rocky. Perhaps sing what? more than Fanjit. Just have your first kiss and then he can... Snosh is a sorba. Tell Wenga. Parsicon. Go ahead and eat that fruit salad. Alright girl, why don't you go ahead... And she doesn't like working out, otherwise I would send her on a jog. So why don't you come over here and practice your speech? What's in door? Um, and leave the spa. For maybe soon, this is where Mario will come in. I in bar and I think actually what we're going to do is we're going to age the girls up today. So what we're going to do mm -hmm. is we're going mm. to send... Oh. Um, <laughs> mommy, daddy, and Hunter to on a vacation. <laughs> they're me. gonna go to uh, Disney World, pretty much. And we're gonna have a birthday party. We are going to throw a rager. Everybody's going. Oh no. Wait, let's sign him up for... I forgot he couldn't get down the stairs. Or you know what? Forrest will take care of him. He'll be like, alright, I'll let you guys have a party. I'll take care of Hunter. It'll be fine. Very, oh, very attractive. Oh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. All right, Ruby's about to age up, guys. Oh, twerk. Twerk. Happy birthday, Ruby! She's gonna be an adult. Ruby aged up into an adult, so she has the romantic and the hot headed traits already so she needs the snob traits next uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. here she is she looks pretty much uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. to be honest and then hurry up and add birthday candles uh -huh. all right rosie come and blow out the candles as well happy oh, birthday to rosie <laughs> you navi wait bow Oh, <laughs> Happy birthday, Rosie! So Rosie is so far she's pretty much the same as her sister, except she wants to find a soulmate. Her last trait we are going to randomize, so she wants to be a gambler. Oh, awesome. Wait, Ooh. Ooh. Nice. <laughs> you can go, girl. Um, uh, why don't you clean that up? Why is she- oh, she has to go. Okay, that's fine. Finish cleaning that up, and then you can come go to the bathroom. Smeba. Okay, so first things first, what we're gonna do is we're going to have Ruby apply for school. Um, first let's look at scholarships. Let's apply for a scholarship. If we can get one, that'd be great. So I'm thinking. So there's clone. Uh, no. Uh, okay. Oh. We're gonna have to just apply for that one, and then oh. we're gonna apply to universities. So I'm only going to be sending Ruby to university because I feel like sending two is gonna be way too much. Um, I don't wanna. University's already hard as is. I mean, I bought a. I bought, I mean, I bought it. I have a mod that makes university a little bit easier, but still, I think it's time for the twins to go their own separate ways and whatnot. So, so for Rosie here, I'm going to give her a job. Let me look at, so based on her skills, she's really good at painting logic. So, let's see. Um, so, she's good at painting and logic. I'm thinking she could be an art teacher. 
Or she could be a painter. Maybe she could do painting? Um, Alright, we're gonna send her off as a painter. So, there we go. Why don't you go ahead and get started on that? When I move Ruby out, I will put the house as unplayed. So they can all do their own thing. Right now, I'm kind of just leading them. So, um, why don't you play game for a little bit here? But yeah, everybody's pretty much doing what they want. We're focusing on Ruby currently. So, here's where we're at. We, I, uh, I also realized in, when I was playing, the volume was super loud. It's because, I don't, I don't even know how to explain it, but I think I fixed it. So, hopefully it's not too loud and it's not too quiet. So, we achieved the level 6 charisma skill already. We need to have three strong romantic relationships at once, and we have to kiss 10 sims. I think this will really, uh, it'll be better when we go to university. I could get a strong relationship with Corey, but I don't necessarily want to because he might be our future. I'm thinking, I'm kind of going with the flow, but I'm also trying to do a story. So I'm thinking he could be like our future guy that we marry as an elder and whatnot. So, cause she really likes him. Like she's always daydreaming about him and whatnot. Max on the other hand, we need to age him up to a young adult. And maybe we can, the cat is really crying a lot. And then maybe we can get him to be one of our, whatever. Oh, he's sleeping. Okay, yeah, why don't you go ahead and go sleep for a little bit. And then based on her skills, she's already level six in the charisma skill and we're just turned to young adult, so we'll be totally fine with that. It's just the aspiration and then the politician career we need to complete, but we're going to university, so we'll get a pretty good jump. I'm not sure exactly how hard, because I don't think I've ever, how hard, how high, because I don't think I ever actually completed university, but. So I always wonder where everybody is in their life. So Charlie is an elder. So is Nina. She's married to Namjoon Kim. That's funny. Who else? Jimin's an elder too? No, Jim. Jimin. Jimin. All of the guys that Mint or people that Mint knew are all elders now, which she should also be an elder, but. Like I said, oh my god, the girls that we were mean to passed away. But like I said, we stopped her aging Joffrey who we were mean to. Uh, we stopped her aging so we could make sure that she meets her grand daughter. Rosie likes Rocky. I don't know if she really likes him. She sees him as very attractive, but not extremely attractive, so... And Fabi Frenoy. She could technically still find somebody else. Potentially when Ruby moves to university and they can do their own thing. Um, she might move on with somebody else. Who knows? Rosie and Forrest have work in an hour. Ruby is pretty good, so why don't you... Let's go invite Max to hang out. Let's go travel with him somewhere. We're gonna ask Max to go somewhere because we need to get our romance up with him. Okay, so she's still in her school uniform, but it's fine. <gasps> Who's this? Oh, I thought that was Cody. So first of all, let's make sure Cody isn't around anywhere. Because if he is, then that's gonna be a big problem. First of all, actually, we're not really worried about being friends. Let's just get this romance right off the bat. We need to be very careful that Cody doesn't show up. Sexy pose. We're almost there. Okay, we did it. It's gonna be kind of helping Rocket out here. It's out of this world. All right, let's go. All right, so we got our romance up high with Max. Okay, so we're at the Geekon with Corey. Oh, he invited us so here. We were just out with Max, and we got it up, and we have a strong romantic relationship with him. I don't want Cody, Corey, 
I don't want Corey to be one of the guys that we do that with because I feel like he might be our end game. Maybe. I do need to throw some CC on him, so actually, why don't we do that really quick? Okay, so Corey here wants to be a painter extraordinaire. He's self absorbed, a perfectionist, so cool. and creative. I feel like him and Ruby are very similar, so. Okay, so I just gave him this look for now. Um, I do need to download more clothes for men, but I think he looks super cute. He definitely looks like uh, Ruby's type, so. Uh, where did he go? Okay, so he came here with Corey. But he left, so let's go home. Send him a flirty text. I guess after I got out of the cast, he left, so. <clears throat> Send him a flirty text and then let's go home. Alright, we got the mail. Did we get our acceptance letter? Ebenor! Our scholarship. We got a scholarship. No, oh, that's the same thing. Did we get. Ooh. Our acceptance letter! Yes! So we were accepted into university, so immediately let's enroll in university! So I'm thinking. Um. We're gonna go to Britchester, but politician, so history. So I changed, shortened the terms to eight classes. I'm gonna see how that is. If that's, that should be two terms, right? Four classes each one. If that seems too short, I'll change it for if I do another generation at university, but we'll see. So politician we're going to have four classes i would take an elective but i want to get it out real quick and we're going to move into drake hall and we have a lot of money in the house and our parents have no problem paying for us so and we have a scholarship oh we have two scholarships merit scholarship and the windipper scholarship nice so we're only paying only $486, I wish. Let's go, oh my God, we're leaving. So obviously we can't survive off of no money. So we're gonna have them give us about, <clears throat> all right, so I'm gonna have them give her just 2,000 just to get her started. And then we're going to the Drake Hall, which we're also gonna look in the gallery for something better. Alright, we're gonna place this one. Ooh, much, much, much better. Much better. Okay, so. <clears throat> I think it's. Should we do a single room or a shared room? I kinda wanna do a shared room. I feel like it makes more sense to me that she would take this pink room. <clears throat> so we're just gonna do this one. We're obviously going to change up the stuff, though. Okay, I think that's good. Okay, so here we are in our brand new room. Come here, girl. Um, we're going to assign this bed to me, and then this bed is assigned to that guy, but we are not going to have that. We'll assign it to some Nanami, whoever that is, right now. But that will also change eventually, probably. Um, so we're not in the high school debate team anymore. This is what we need to be a part of here. So in three hours, are you the type who always needs to get by the last or the last word? Okay, okay. So we're going to join that for sure. And then let's also put our computer security lock the computer for everybody everyone but ruby only i can use it none of y'all can come in here so what we're first thing first is we're going to change her appearance we are in university now so it's time to change up our look so i actually still really like the way she looks to be honest 
Maybe we can just change up a few things. Nothing crazy. Maybe a few makeup details. I actually like everything. I just changed up her eyebrows. But everything else I think I'm going to keep. So let's look at the hairs. I really like her hair like this, but maybe it is time to change it up a little bit. This is, ooh, hold on. This is actually perfect. It like is still very cute, like the headband look, but it's not as <laughs> childish, I guess you could say. I really like this. And then for her outfits, I love this outfit, of course, but we need to change it. Red nails, of course. And then maybe like a, A reddish book bag. That's cute. Okay, this is one outfit, and then let's do another outfit. I think I'm gonna go with this one. This is a very college y outfit, right? Okay, she looks so cute. Okay, so this is the new Ruby Berry, guys. This is one of her everyday outfits really cute and then this is another everyday outfit let me know what you guys think of it very cute this is her form outfit she's in college now so it's a little more provocative i guess you could say still cute athletic outfits still the same um her sleep outfit i left the same her party outfit i really like so i also left the same swimwear is the same Hot weather. I haven't seen her in this outfit yet. I don't think she's even worn it yet. So I'm going to leave that the same as well. And then cold weather, I left the same as well. So that's her, guys. Super exciting. Okay, so here we are. So we still need to go to this meeting, but it's not until 4. So we have some time still. So why don't we meet our roommates? Polite introduction, funny introduction, respectful introduction. Oh, this is Nanami. She is our roommate as of right now. So I'm thinking about changing it and having our friends like from when we were teenagers live here. So I was thinking about doing that and then making one of them our roommate. So that is a possibility. She looks so cute. All right, yeah, say yeah, hi to everybody. Oh, I four, I have... Maybe. Nay. Say hi guys, it's nice to meet you. I'm new here. All right guys, I think that that is a good place to stop. We finally got into university. Our girl Ruby is on her own, so. The next episode, we are going to start university officially, and I think we're going to move um, Autumn and Candace into our dorms as our roommates, um, so that way we have a little bit of home and friends who have CC on them. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, and also don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell so you never miss when I post. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you next time. Bye!